Hello friends. So for those who missed, we read a book and it is titled Kindergarten Rocks. So we started kindergarten this year and so did our friend in the store. We're going to find out what his name is, but to start out, we have our title Kindergarten Rocks. I'm telling you Dex, Kindergarten Rocks. My name is Dexter Dungan, and I know everything about kindergarten. This is because I'm going to be a kindergartner very soon. Next month, practically. It's next week, Dexter. I'm an expert because my big sister, Jessie, went there one time too. My dog, Rufus, is a teensy bit scared about kindergarten. You don't have to be scared, Dexter. You're going to love it. And there's his sister, Jessie. Jessie went to kindergarten a long time ago, but she still remembers it, even though she's going into third grade. Rufus is scared that I'll get lost on the way to school. The bus driver knows the way. Don't worry, kindergarten rocks. Jessie went to kindergarten too. She wasn't big like she is now. I was a shrimp just like you. See, they have the same school supplies as some of us. She wrote like me and drew like me too, only not as good. I got Jessie to help me make a list of things Rufus was scared about. I'm not worried though. Kindergarten will be a piece of cake. No problem. I can't wait. So if we notice his face, he says he can't wait, but he looks a little scared. Just like some of us are. When the bus came the next morning, the driver seemed like he knew what he was doing. So I got on. Jess, Rufus is scared I might get lost. You won't. But what if I do? You won't. What if I forget a map and get lost? You won't. I might. You won't. What if I do? I'm not that lucky, said Jessie. So how silly, they're getting on the school bus together. Rufus was still worried, but Jessie had a good idea. If Rufus is scared, just give him a hug. Just like we could do that to ourselves. We get scared, give ourselves a big hug. When we finally got to school, I couldn't wait to see my classroom. Hi, Dexter. I'm Miss Sugarman. I'm your teacher. There are some kind of good surprises about kindergarten. So just like my name is Miss Lisa and I'm your teacher. He also has a teacher and her name is Miss Sugarman. For one thing, my friend Joey from preschool is there. Rufus was happy to see him. He forgot to worry. We made art. I think Rufus wants to lick the spoon and cooked food and smushed Play-Doh. I got to write letters and build towers and play in the imagination station and look at books. So some of the same exciting stuff that you guys may be doing at your house right now. Then we went to the library that's where you go if you want to know about snails or soccer or out of space or shark guts. You can borrow a whole book all about it and keep it for practically forever. At lunch, you get to eat with all of your friends in the cafeteria. It's exactly almost like a restaurant. Oh no, 
you're going to be in trouble. He thinks he's going to be in trouble because he accidentally spilled his milk. We have a library and cafeteria here at school too for when you guys come back. And there are people called custodians who clean the entire school and they help you even when you spill your milk by accident and you're scared you'll get in trouble. How about I help you wipe this up? Thank you. We have some office custodians at our school as well, Mr. Daryl and Mr. Johnny, Ms. Rosa and Ms. Kathy. So we have great people too who also help keep our school safe and clean. After lunch, everyone goes to recess. Same here at our school. Joey says you can't get lost playing. I am a monster and you are a powerful monster getter. Because if someone's always chasing you, how can you get lost? Wait a second. Where's Rufus? Rufus is gone. Oh no, Rufus is lost. If you remember, that was his stuffed dog that he was carrying around. Uh-oh. Why don't we get Jesse to help you find him? Maybe I left him in the cafeteria. We can check on him in the library. It's down the hall. Let's see if he's on the playground. Rufus is lost. Don't worry, said Jesse. I think he'll be okay. So if you notice, they're looking all around the school, back where he was today, looking for Rufus. <sighs> Rufus is gone. We can't find him anywhere. Wait a second, he's not lost. There he is. Rufus was ha so happy to see me. He knew I'd find him the whole time. You're staying home from now on. If we notice in the story, if you look really closely, there's Rufus hanging out. So he wasn't actually lost. I'm going to learn lots of stuff in kindergarten. But the one thing I learned today, kindergarten rocks. I told you so, said Jesse. So even though he was scared, he still had a great day in kindergarten. Now, what is first grade gonna be like? So there's our story, Kindergarten Rocks. The title is Kindergarten Rocks. And the author was Katie Davis. That's who wrote the book. And it says she illustrated as well. So written and illustrated by Katie Davis. So she not only wrote it, she did the pictures as well. So hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.